How do you the first Dorcas? How do you the first culprit in the ministry? Now do you have to shikwa wa kwanza walale ndani? Kwa sababu uh, tukikumbuka hapo awali tetesi zilikuwa ya kwamba mkewe rais aligeuza maji fulani alisurify maji fulani mahali he should be arrested and taken to court and produce evidence on how he purified that water <laughs> so tunataka ya kwanza Ezekiel achiliwe recho ashikwe pamoja na Ruto kwa sababu nimeona Ruto katika vyombo vya taarifa vya habari kanisani akitoa machozi na mimi najua machozi unafaa kutoa wakati unaona maskini yakiangaika. Ruto unatoa machozi na maskini bado wanazidi kuangaika. Unatoa machozi na ulitudanganya. Ukasema utaweka mama mboga na mtu wa ndudhi. Kim ni mtu wa ndudhi hapa baada hajaipata kazi. Uliweka <laughs> siyesu wapi? Hatujiona mtu wa chini yeyote hata mmoja. Kim tuko naye hapa, si ndio? Watu wote ambao walikupigia kura mama mboga tunawaona hapa hapa kwenye bunge kwani serikali ni ya kina nani na ulisema kwamba serikali ni ya watu wa chini ni mama mboga na ni watu wa ndudhi wako wapi tuliona wale wa mama wenye ulichagua ni kina omanga ambao wanamangana katika manyumba tofauti tofauti Mr President we want to tell you that the direction religion is taking in this nation is very worse It is very worse and it is being Mimi naamini ya kwamba watu wanafata mienendo yako kwa sababu unabiri unahubiri uongo sasa wamechukua wako na authority kama rais ndiye anafanya hivi sembuse sisi acha twende tuwadanganye wafunge wakufe ndio maana unaona haya na Mr President the poverty in this nation ndio inafanya wa Kenya wanadanganywa na watu kama hawa ni umaskini ndio maana inawapeleka katika makanisa haya Bwana Ezekiel sikuona Yesu akiuza maji, sijui mazi yako ni gani. Sijaiona Yesu akiuza mafuta, sijui mafuta yako hii ni gani ambao mnauzia watu. Pastor Kanyari, pastor sijui hawa gasia yote ambayo imetajwa hapa. Hawa wote ni matapeli. And we will say hawa ni matapeli, makanisa yao yote inafaa kufungwa. We need not to provoke God. You are provoking God. That is why day and night magari na uwa watoto wetu katika barabara ndio maana wazazi wetu wanakufu katika ajali kwa sababu neema ya Mungu imetuacha because the government have allowed this nonsense back to politics Raila is returning home tomorrow and say uh, barazas will resume people's baraza will resume should Ruto be worried Ruto should be very worried Sema very worried. Very worried that is how Ruto should be because the real president is coming back. And when the president with his utmost power is coming back, you will see you will just see by yourself who the president is. And we are asking William Samoe Ruto. You know all along we have been asking for peace. On all this demonstration we have been going peacefully and you have tried bringing war don't forget that these people know how to fight but they like peace that is why they are giving you peace please don't push a citizen kwa kona kabisa kumbuka paka ukimkosa mahali pa kutoroka unapompiga ni wewe atakuvamia ruto wetu katuvamia wewe na tunakuambia hiyo kwa sababu gani tunasema hii maandamano yetu ama the people's baraza have always been peaceful very 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 peaceful lakini kwa sababu yako na uwizi na utapeli ambao mko nao mnatuletea wakora mnatuletea wezi mnatuletea polisi wakatupiga na tear gas na wezi wetu wana, wezi wenyu wanatuibia tunakuambia we are not going to allow that we are not going to allow that at any given point dakika moja yangu nikimaliza has udaku democratic alliance met your expectation as a kenyan whose expectation kama watu wenye waliwapigia kura si kuna mama mboga walienda na yeye ku launch sijui gas ya gani ako wapi si kuna mtu wa ndudhi ambaye alichukuliwa wakati ule ako wapi in fact muliongeza bei ya mafuta ndio watu wa ndudhi wasiweze kufanya biashara so there is nothing like expectation we didn't expect anything and that is why what you are really busy delivering mr president We are very very big learned people who can propel the economy of this nation. 
we have got people ambao wako na economical strategies ambazo zinaweza fanya mtu wa chini akapate manufaa ya ile kazi ambayo anafanya kwa hivyo tumechoka na utapeli yako na hatutawai amini kwako kwa hivyo mr speaker namalizia na kusema ya kwamba ikiwa kweli Mungu anatupenda jinsi ameanza kufukua hawa mapasta wa uongo vivyo hivyo pia afukue ule ule jamaa ambaye amejificha state house please I'm sure ukitaka kujua kwamba serikali inajua hii mambo ya hawa mapastors wewe tafuta enda fungua nyumba ya kuomba pale na uweke msalaba hapo nje kesho utaona serikali inakuja kukuuliza are you registered and what are you doing but because they have got hand in this they are sacrificing innocent Kenyans that is why this thing have been continuing inaendelea inaendelea na wamenyamazia matapeli hawa ma illuminati asante sana bwana speaker